What's up, everyone? Today we're gonna draw a crow from Brawl Stars. Before we start, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. Let's get started. For this video, you're gonna need a pencil, eraser, just in case you make any mistakes, some colors to draw a crow. And I'm gonna use um, a marker or you can a permanent one to trace the lines and make it look a little more darker. Okay, let's get started. First, let's make um, a triangle like that and out. Now let's make another thing here, but smaller. Now let's go down all the way to there, okay? Okay, now let's make the same thing we did there. Another triangle there, like that. And go all the way down like there. Now, good, let me make that a little longer, like that. Good, now let's make crow's beak, which is right here. Let's start making the beak. Let's make, um, starting here, a line like that, all the way to there, okay? Now let's continue and go down like that, okay? Let's make like some curves there, okay? So let's continue over here and do like that. Now let's continue a little more and do like that, okay? Now let's make, go down and, and in and like a mad face there. Like that, okay? Wait, I did this a little wrong. Let me fix this a little, okay? Let's do like that now and make his face a little more like that, a little more straighter on the lines and connect that there, good. Now let's make a circle like that, leaving a, a which is like his nose, okay? Okay, now let's make a triangle well, no, a star that's without five, um, without five um, points. We're gonna make with with four, okay? Like that, that, like that, and like that. Okay, good. Now let's make a line like that and connect that there. Okay, good. Now, let's start over here and connect that over there, like that. Okay, let me make this a little more straighter. Like, like bigger, a little more bigger. We want it in straighter. Let's do it like that, okay? We'll like do it like that. Let me make it a little more longer. Like that. Okay, good, that's better. Now let's start over here and go all the way down and do up and connect that there. So that's gonna be his eyebrow and here we're gonna put his eye. Okay, let's make his eye, we'll start over here and do like that. Okay, and that's his eye. And now let's make the black part that's in the middle of his eye. And we'll paint that inside with the color. Like that, okay? Good. Wait. Let me make this a little more. Let me make that black part a little more in the middle, okay? Like over here. 
here, okay? Yeah, not so much of a difference, <laughs> but okay, so we'll stop there, okay? Now we're gonna go then like that and do like that. Like his cheek is coming out, okay? And now we're going to make his other eye. So we'll do like that and connect that there like that, okay? Now we'll make a bigger eye, which is going to go like that and connect that there, okay? Let's make that black thing in his eye again and paint it in the middle with black. Good. Now let's make sort of a triangle over here like that on his eye okay now we're gonna make a little bit of his body so we'll start over here and go like that okay now we'll continue over here and stop there Okay, so we're like doing uh, like that, okay? Now we'll start over here and connect that all the way to there. Okay, now let's make a line like that and do that and connect that there, okay? Good, we'll make like a sort of a circle here like that, and we'll make a line in the middle there, okay? Good, now let's make a curve like that in his chest, which is, that's where his chest is, and his jack is like covering it a little. And now we'll start over here and go in like that. We'll connect that over here like that. Like that, okay? We'll continue over here like that and connect that and make a line like that and and we'll keep going up and and connect that there. Wait one second, let me make let me fix this a little. Like that. This part's a little tricky because you have to angle it in the right place. So it's a little hard. You can skip this part if you want. But I just finished it, so you didn't have to. Okay? So let's make a squirrel like that. And now we're going to do a circle like that. Like we did on the other side and make a line there. He, here, we have to make it hard as well. This hard part is a little hard too because you have to put it together and make it small or big. It's a little hard, okay? Okay, so I see it is a little hard, so you can skip this part, I told you, and you can see the rest. So let me continue and try to make it good. And we'll make a line like that, okay? Now let's make a square again. And we'll make that like circle thing again. And we'll make a line in there like that. Okay, that's better. And now we'll start over here. And do like that. Now we'll go down a little more like that, okay? We're gonna do another curve like that and do like that, okay? Oh good, now let's make a line here like that. And continue like that. That's where his hand is gonna be. So we're gonna continue over here. Let's do like that. And let's make a square over here and here we'll do the same thing, but a little longer like that. Okay, like he's wearing a bracelet or something around his wrist. So let's continue over here and make a little line there. Now let's do a, a little curve like that and make a 
circle or square, a knowable, I would say. So that's going to be his pocket, okay? So that's like his pocket where he, on his jacket, okay? Now we're going to make a line here like that, okay? Good. Now let's make his uh, little lines over here like that. That's where his hand is going to be, and he's going to hold his weapon, okay? We'll leave that like that for now, and let's continue over here and do the other hand. Let's do a curve like that, in and out, and do it like that. And then we'll make a line there, a line here, and a line there, okay? So, like, you can see it a little. And then we'll do all the way to here like that. And and do it like that, okay? Let me fix this a little. I have to make it a little more curve like his elbow there like his elbows there, so we have to curve it a little more like that. So like he's bending his arm more, okay? Okay, good, that's better. Let's make a line over here like that. And start over here, I guess, and do like that, okay? Okay. Now we'll make a line like that. And all the way to there. Now we'll make a... A line over here like that little and connect that and we'll do like that okay so that's where his other hand is gonna go so let's make another line over here like that let's make a detail over here like that and we'll leave it like that okay let me make a two little lines there like he's bending a little and then we'll go down over here and stop there. Okay. Now let's start over here and go connect that all the way to there. Okay. Now we'll start over here and make a square like that. And a square like that. And another one like that. Okay. A lot of, a lot of squares and rectangles. Okay. Good. Now let's make his other his other pocket, which goes like that. Okay. Make another rectangle for his pocket like that. Now let's make two lines like that, and we'll connect them like that. Let's do it like that. Go down and go down. So that's like where his zipper comes, like connecting his jacket. And here we'll put his zipper. So we'll start over here and do like that. Now we'll make, we'll continue over here and do like that. Wait, let me make this. Wait, no. It's good, it's good. No, wait. Let me make a line like that a little. I thought it was too fat, but no, it's good, okay? So let's make a line like that. And go in like that. And make a curve over here like that. Go in and out like that, okay? We'll connect that there a little. And okay, now we'll make um, a line over there and make a square like that and then we'll connect that over here okay let's make a rectangle in here with a little line in the middle okay okay so that's gonna be like a zipper and now let's make this line a little more bigger let's continue over here and do like that okay Good. We have his whole jacket, and now we're going to make a crow's hand over here, okay? 
So I'll start over here and do like that. Okay, and then we'll go a little more down like that and do it like that, okay? Now let's leave a little space there like that. Wait, let me make it a little more not so sharpy. Let's make it a little more like that. Well, there's not that much difference. I just made it a little more bigger like that, okay? So let's start over here and do it like that, okay? I put detail on the thumb there, as you can see. And let's make some lines over here and another one there. Let's make a detail over here like that, okay? And good, we m finished his hand over here. Now let's make his other hand, which is holding his weapon over here, okay? So we'll start over here a little and we'll make his thumb and we'll do like in like that and do like that like that wait let me make this a little more thinner like that that's better okay good now let's make a line like that and now start over here and make a circle like that. Let's make another circle in the middle like that. Like his thumb is holding a circle, okay? Now we're gonna make, starting here, is a big line like that, okay? Now we're gonna make um, a line like that and do like that. That's gonna be his finger, okay? And he's gonna be like holding his, his, his weapon with his pinky there like that, okay? So let's make, we'll make a line over here like that. We'll make a triangle, okay? Like that, okay? Wait, let me make his finger a little more little because his pinky is an enormous. So let's make it a little more littler like that. Okay, and we'll connect that there. That's better, okay? And now we'll continue that triangle that we did over here and we'll make a line in here like that. Let's make another triangle over here like that and connect it all the way to there and make another line in the middle there okay so starting here we're gonna make a line like that go in out and go like that and connect that there okay let's make that a little more pinchier like that and let's make another line in the middle there okay good now let's make the other um thing over here and we'll start over here do like that that okay now do like that in out and connect that there okay let's make a line over here like that now finally we're gonna make the last triangle over here with a line in the middle like that Good, we finished both of his hands with his weapon, and now we're going to make his feet, his legs, and his, and his pants, okay? So let's make them over here, okay? So we'll start over here and do like that. Now we're going to go over here and leave a little space and go like that. Okay, here we're gonna make a line like that going all the way down to there, okay? Let's make a line like that and do like that, okay? Like that a little way, like that, okay? Now here we're gonna make a line like that and 
go down and leave a little space there and do like that and connect that all the way to there. So that's going to be like his boot and let's make a line over here, okay? That's going to be like his boot or his shoe, okay? So let's make a line over here like that, okay? Now here we're going to make uh, like that. And here we'll connect that there. We'll make that a little sharpie, like that. And we'll make a line here like that. Now here we're going to make a line like that and connect that there. Here we're going to make a line there like that, okay? Okay, good. We finished Crow. With all the details, the hands, feet, and hands. And now I'm going to trace the part where I trace Crow with the black. I'm going to fast forward it, okay? So you can do it too if you want to make it a little darker, okay? So here I go. Let me start. Okay, we finished tracing crow with black, and now I'm going to fast forward it again, but with all of the colors for crow. And one thing, crow is pretty easy. He doesn't have that many colors, okay? So when you, if you paint him, it probably will be easy, okay? So let's go. Okay, guys, I finished drawing Crow with all the colors. Okay, and now he's, and now I'm going to tell you what colors I used. Um, for his eyebrows, his hand, his, his chest, that thing, I used a black, normal black. And for his head here, I used black, but I did it a little softer, okay? And then for the beak, I used a gray, and I used it for the weapon, that, the, and these little squares and that. Then I used a black and made his jacket, and then I mixed it. But then I mixed it, of course, with a little blue to make it uh, a little more darker. Dark blue I used, okay? And then for his pockets, that, 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 and that, I used a dark brown, coffee brown, and I painted it all with that. Then for his pants, I used this light brown and for this brown a little i used a lighter brown to make it a little more lighter because his pants are a little more lighter okay and here you have crow you can pause the video if you want to copy the colors and we'll see you in the next video and Oh, and by the way, I hope you enjoyed drawing Crow. He was really easy, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.